Hey there, and welcome back to another episode of This Guy's Thoughts. I like always, I appreciate swinging by and watching a beer review here on the channel. Uh, tonight's episode, we got a couple beers here, as you can see, out of uh, Duclaw Brewing. This here is their Sweet Baby Jesus and the Sweet Baby Java. Uh, I picked these both up, $1.79 a bottle. I'm going to shoot a back-to-back -back review here. I'm going to review the uh, Sweet Baby Jesus first, the base beer. And then we will uh, jump into the Sweet Baby uh, Java in the next video. It'll be two separate uploads. Uh, this is basically a chocolate uh, peanut butter porter. And the uh, Java version has espresso added to it. So let's focus on this here. They are 6.2% uh, alcohol by volume. And this one here, the uh, Sweet Baby Jesus, is uh, what I write down, uh, 33 on the IBU, okay? Uh, it says... Uh, all it says chocolate peanut butter porter is all it says on there. Uh, I don't have a Best Buy date or anything like that. Uh, craft, but craft be cherished, rules be damned. Uh, right there on the bottle cap of Duclaw, uh, or Duclaw Brewing. So let's go ahead and uh, crack this open. As far as the artwork goes, you know, three and a half out of five. The name is actually pretty cool. Sweet Baby Jesus, Sweet Baby Java. I, I actually... I uh, like the name. Um, let me grab the uh, bottle opener here. So I've never, I have not had this before, either one of these. Uh, I don't know a whole lot about them or anything. So um, go ahead and get a pour on it and see what it's all about. It's got a nice uh, light brown, light brown. Um, to a tan head up on it. Go ahead and set that sweet baby Jesus bottle up there for you. So, uh, just a, it's not quite a black. It almost had a reddish, dark brown slash reddish tint to it as I was pouring it in the glass. It does come across uh, as very uh, dark, very black. Uh, just over a finger. Uh, I had about a finger, a half a head on top of this. As you can see, um, just a tannish light brown tannish colored head on top of this as far as aroma typical peanut butter porter aroma maybe a, a candied um like a candy peanut butter like peanut butter candy is kind of what it smells like chocolate there's some chocolate in there, like maybe a bittery, bittery cocoa, uh, something like that. A bittery chocolate, bittery cocoa-ness coming off of this. It does. It smells just like those, uh, just candy, peanut butter, uh, peanut butter candies. Anyhow, let's get a drink on this and uh, see what it's all about. First drink there. Um, Kind of creamy, really. Not crazy, crazy, crazy. Not crazy creaminess, but there is some substance to the body. I'm gonna say uh, thinner side, medium body, mouth fill. Uh, there's a nice bittery, uh, like a real bittery chocolateness to this. Mild on the peanut butter taste. Um, I can actually, it seems a little bit more chocolatey than peanut buttery. Maybe uh, like a Nutello type of um, a flavor to this here. I was actually hoping for a little bit more peanut butter if I'm being absolutely honest with you. A lot of these porters, these peanut butter beers, they don't always deliver on the peanut butter. So this is typical uh, to the style, in my opinion, my experience with the peanut butter porter style. But actually, um, it's not bad. It's actually very, uh, very easy drinking. Um, as far as scoring this here, uh, I'm good. I'm good with maybe a four out of five. It's a solid drinking. Uh, drinking um, chocolate peanut butter 
porter, which is a little bit uh, a little bit more on the chocolatey side. Uh, the bittery, cocoa-y chocolate uh, side than, um, than the peanut butter, unfortunately. So that is a bit of a letdown. Uh, but anyhow, you know, I'm good, I'm good with a four out of five on this. I have no problem. Um, I have no problem drinking this. Um, I'd probably drink this again, no doubt. Um, just, uh, it's a solid drinker. You had this before, let me know what you think about it. I know many people have had this before. Very popular beer. Uh, it's Duclaw Brewing Company. This is our Sweet Baby Jesus. Uh, I'm going to finish this off, and I'm going to go ahead and shoot the video for the uh, Java. So be sure to check out both of those videos.